Welcome to another episode of Carbs. You're not see no choice in the car. And BS, while consuming carbs, Matt Zion here. We're going to be trying brand new flavor of Sour Patch. Well, it's kind of a lie, because I think that these were already, weren't these already mixed in with the regular Sour Patch kids? I'm not entirely sure on the subject, but it's Sour Patch Strawberry flavor. Now, these are just strawberry. That's it. It's exclusively strawberry throughout the entire bag. Let's try these things out. Uh, Sour Patch Kids, more so just Lori's thing. I've said that many times before. My girlfriends, she really likes Sour Patch Kids. I'm not a big fan, but I think I might like these because of the sour, like the extra sour. Like these look like they're more coated than the usual Sour Patch Kids, but that's because the usual ones, they have to show the definition of the children that you're slowly consuming into your mouth. Let's try these things out. Here we go. Same exact problem as regular Sour Patch Kids. Just way too chewy. Way too. It's way too chewy when it should be more Han Solo. I feel like if I hadn't... I've gotten a lot of dental work done. I've spent like thousands of dollars at this point on getting my teeth fixed. I got... Uh, I think I still have two more to go, but I've got uh, seven fillings total. I had a root canal and I had two crowns placed. So, like, one was a replace of an old crown from, like, 10 years ago. So, if, if I hadn't had all that done, I wouldn't feel confident eating these. I would think that something would happen to my teeth. <laughs> you know, I would avoid anything overly chewy and anything overly, uh, overly hard. Like, nerds are just, like, I literally had to get one of my teeth uh, just completely taken care of when I was younger, like, 10 years ago, because a nerd just cracked the center down the middle. Now, of course, that was my fault, because the tooth probably was already having problems, but... I just wouldn't trust it. I think that they've got good flavor. I think it could be better. I feel like I always compare strawberry gummies to, I don't know if you ever remember the little like cherries that are like connected. I, I don't remember exactly who made them, but I know I would go to our local, uh, there was a candy shop. I think it's still there on Glendora Avenue in Glendora, California. And uh, they would always have those gummies. And as a kid, I would get those and they just had the best flavor out of every possible gummy. These are still good, but they don't live up to that. I just feel it's a little dull. I feel like it's it's just, oh God, I would eat a couple of these and I'd just be done. I ate one and I'm already done. But like if I took these into a movie theater, I couldn't have any more than maybe four or five before I would just tap out. They don't have the repeat eatability of a, say like a Skittles. I would give these a very high three. I just don't think that they're particularly good. There's something about Sour Patch Kids I have just never personally liked. And I don't think I ever will. I think the, the gum's probably better than this. So there you go, guys. That's that. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode.